How's it going guys? It's Nate. I'm back with another reaction. Today I am reacting to Life Experiences, Wrong Words, featuring Casey Rice. suggested this for me and I'm excited to react to it I I don't know why I didn't I don't know why I stopped reacting to stuff like this because it's some of my favorite stuff it's it's one of my favorite art forms dance mixed with good music and good choreography and Sean and Casey have just such charisma with their dance and with their storytelling in dance and I absolutely love it so I don't know why I stopped uh, I just got away from it somehow and and I'm excited to jump in here to see what this one is um, when you guys said it was kind of a prequel to one of the scenes from an unspoken narrative and I'm just I'm just hype so I already reacted to one and I'm, I'm excited to react to this one so good okay let's go let's good go and jump right in here if you guys like my videos make sure to like and subscribe and also comment below what you want me to be reacting to what your favorite artist is dance music whatever it is or even just like thought um, I've been starting to branch out and do some more like stuff that is really passionate to me um, which is like thought philosophy um, so comment below let me know what you think what you think I should be reacting to but as it is let's go and jump right in here and see what we got Life Experiences, Wrong Words, featuring Casey Rice. what I expected It's not what I intended It's not the message I've been sending No, no All of the colors are bleeding from my head All of the colors paint a picture in my head It's falling apart But it's perfectly perfect like they say nothing's perfect but this picture's perfect everything was worth it in the end you said it straight i turned it but the glass gets dirty around 11 30 i hit send somehow um this the story is a little like you're not sure exactly what's going on it's called life experiences and it's like okay this so far is like uncomfortable and kind of like puts you on edge you're like what's going on um so it's interesting it's called life er wrong words life experiences wrong words okay um it's interesting it's interesting i I'm catching the narrative a little bit, but it's, it's, let's just keep going. <laughs> Straight up. 
I aspire to this level of flexibility. <laughs> Even I think stretching and like being flexible, I think dance would be like a really like helpful way to be, just be healthy in general. <laughs> but these guys are oh, they're so good. <laughs> Yeah. No, I mean, the message is good. Um, you know, wrong words. The wrong words won't only hurt others, but also yourself in the end. That's that's a great message. Um, one thing, I'm, I'm, I'm an artistic person, and uh, my mind runs wild with, like, ideas, especially when I'm creating. So a lot of times when coming up with a story or coming up with a... Uh, a narrative I have trouble being clear with it or concise I I have so many ideas and they're running and and I love metaphor and symbolism and so uh, I found that when I'm writing and I haven't mastered it by any sense of the imagination but I have to start with a structure a laid out outline otherwise I just can't I I go so wild and then I just get like it's too much and then I don't end up even writing either what I want or what it needs to be so and and I sense that sometimes in movies and music videos and stories where the story is and that's partially art art will uh, put itself forward in a in a beautiful way that people can interpret differently and I love that and I, and I want to create stuff like that. But if it's too convoluted and too, too not clear enough, um, then, it's, then it's, it, it sways out of what people can connect to. And people have to connect to something. And people especially connect to story. And story if they can relate themselves to something or somebody in the story. So uh, I love this idea. And, and I've really like critiqued myself on this and kind of like this I feel like it was a little convoluted where you're like you're not sure what's going on you can pull stuff from it and that's the artistic side of it which I love and I and I again I critique but like I absolutely love this it is beautiful it's dark it's gritty it's it's it keeps you on edge it's got a great message but for myself I've got to like I, I see myself creating something like this that I, I, I would want to make it a little more clear um, of what's going on so people can be like, oh, and connect to it. And that's just myself. I really appreciate you suggesting me watch this. I really enjoyed it. And as usual with Casey Rice, Sean Liu, just incredible artists, incredible dancers. Um, I don't know who choreographed this one. If you guys know, let me know. But uh, it's, it's just so well done and, and like, I, I love it. I love it. And the big thing is the, these people created this. They came together, worked it out, and did it. And that's something that's huge, huge, that so many people aren't doing. Or if they are, it's under corporate or, or big budget, you know, uh, agenda pushing type things. This is just small creators just doing it and I love that and that's something that I'm really hungering for in my own life is working with people I'm doing my own little stuff but working with people that are actually work doing stuff you know putting stuff out I've even helped or tried to help certain people you know get started in in their own you know creative field 
and and you know give them advice and and you know if they ask for it help them whatever and then they end up doing nothing and I've seen that over and over again and that's and that's the reality is like you can have ideas and everybody has ideas it's the implementation and doing that will set you apart and it's just like just do it you have to just dive in it's not gonna be perfect it's gonna be far from perfect just do it and that's kind of this like uh, this was is a few years old I would love I would love to see what these people are doing now because I know it's better already because they're doing and and uh, and you just get better as you go and and this is beautiful and amazing and obviously uh, has done well and people love it but even better and it's just like that's so cool because this is the starting point let's go so I really appreciate you guys suggesting this for me thanks so much for watching guys hopefully you enjoyed this video if you did like comment and subscribe also if you have any suggestions drop them down in the comments I would love to see what you guys are listening to and check it out make sure to also go check out the patreon that is where you can help support this channel we're to that next level link in the description below thanks for watching guys I'll catch you in the next video peace